Have you ever wondered how a piano works or how sound is produced? Well, lucky for you, that's what I'm going to explain in this video. The piano was invented at the end of the 17th century and had become widespread in Western society by the end of the 18th century and is widely played today. At the time of the piano's origin, around the year 1700, the piano was an ideal invention made by the well-played craftsman and inventor Bartolomeo Cristofori. The piano was considered as an extremely expensive item. For a long time after its invention, the piano was largely owned by royalty, for example, the kings of Portugal. Later on, throughout the 18th and early 19th century, pianos were still very expensive for most families, and the pianos of those times were generally the property of the high class. There are two different types of pianos, the upright piano and the grand piano. In a piano, when a key is struck, a chain reaction occurs to produce a sound. First, the key raises the whip in, which forces the jack against the hammer roller. The hammer roller then lifts the lever, carrying the hammer. The key also raises the damper and immediately after the hammer strikes the wire it falls back, allowing the wire to vibrate. When the key is released, the damper falls back onto the strings, stopping the wire from vibrating. The vibrating piano strings themselves are not very loud, but their vibrations are transmitted to a large soundboard that moves air and then converts the energy to sound. There are three ways a piano can amplify sound. The first way is by trying harder. What this means is that when a piano key is struck with a greater force, the sound produced is louder, whereas if the piano key is struck with a softer force, the sound produced is softer. The other two ways sound can be amplified in piano is by vibrating strings and resonance. The pitch of the sound a piano makes depends on what the string or wire of the piano is made of, as well as its thickness, its length, and how tight it's strung between its bows. For example, high-pitched notes come from shorter, lighter, tighter strings, whereas thinner, looser, longer strings produce lower pitch notes. In the family of pianos, there can be slight sound variations. For example, in a grand piano, the sound produced is louder, richer, and lower. Whereas in an upright piano, the sound produced is more warming, charming, and compact. All in all, pianos make beautiful music. Each one is unique depending on their interior design and the different materials that it's made out of, such as hardwood like maple or beech, which affects the pitch and altitude of the it also depends on the person playing the piano. This matters because it depends on how hard they push the